Is it the right time to buy or sell Marathon Patent stock? Today, we're going to take a deep dive into Marathon Patent. We previously shared a report on our website on Tuesday, January 9, 2024, but now we're back with an even more detailed analysis. Make sure to subscribe, hit the like button, and turn on the notification bell so you never miss any important updates that could impact your investments. Looking to improve your trading decisions? Check out our newly launched AI stock analysis tool powered by GPT-4 at stockinvest.us. With this tool, you can tap into the power of AI and receive free price predictions and in-depth analysis for any of the 25,000 companies worldwide. Remember, this video is for informational purposes only and should not be considered as financial advice. As of November 14, 2023, our system has identified Marathon Patent as a strong buy candidate, with a score of 2.64. Now, let's dive into the stock's performance during this period. If you followed our analysis, you would have seen a remarkable gain of 180.59% since we first recommended Marathon Patent as a buy 38 days ago. This means an average daily return of 4.75% since it was listed as a buy candidate. In the short term, the stock is in the middle of a strong upward trend, indicating further potential for growth. Looking at the next three months, the current trend suggests a possible 155% change, with a potential return ranging from 103.80% to 234.13%. Considering the 12-month trend, there is a projected 42.24% change, with a potential return between minus 46.05% and 73.4%. This means the stock price could range from $13.88 to $44.62 after a year. Our latest update on Marathon Patent reveals that the stock price closed at $25.73 on Tuesday, experiencing a decrease of 0.96%. On Tuesday, January 9, 2024, the Marathon Patent stock price declined by 0.96%, dropping from $25.98 to $25.73. Throughout the trading day, the stock fluctuated by 7.76%, reaching a low of $24.75 and a high of $26.67. Over the past two weeks, there has been a loss of 3.67%. It's worth noting that the decrease in volume aligns with the decline in stock price, indicating a positive trend. On the last trading day, the volume decreased by 34 million shares, and a total of 78 million shares were traded, amounting to approximately $2.01 billion. Looking at the past 52 weeks, the highest price for Marathon Patent stock was $31.30, while the lowest price was $4.76. Currently, the stock price is 17.8%, or $5.57, below the 52-week high and 69.17%, or $57.72, below the all-time high on November 9, 2021, when the price reached $83.45. Analyst Ratings On Friday, September 23, 2022, BTIG downgraded Mara to a neutral grade. On Thursday, August 11, 2022, Jeffries upgraded Mara to a bike grade. On Tuesday, July 12, 2022, B. Riley Securities maintained a neutral grade with a hold action for Mara. On Friday, June 24, 2022, Cowan and Company initiated coverage on Mara with a market perform grade. On Friday, June 3, 2022, BTIG upgraded Mara to a buy grade. Analysts have given Marathon Patent stock a general buy rating. They believe the P-E ratio is a strong buy and the price-to-book ratio is also considered a strong buy. However, when it comes to return on investment, the analysts give the stock a strong sell rating. Let's take a look at the signals for Marathon Patent Stock. The stock is showing positive signs as it has buy signals from both short and long-term moving averages. This indicates a positive forecast for the stock. Additionally, the relation between the two signals shows a general buy signal, with the short-term average positioned above the long-term average. In case of corrections down, there is support from the lines at $24.57 and $18.54.
However, if the stock breaks below these levels, it will issue sell signals. It's important to note that there are some negative signals that may have an impact on the near short-term development of the stock. A sell signal was issued from a pivot top point on Wednesday, December 27, 2023, resulting in a minus 17.19% decrease so far. Further decline is indicated until a new bottom pivot is found. Additionally, there is currently a sell signal from the three-month moving average convergence divergence, MACD. On the last trading day, volume fell along with the price, which reduces the overall risk, as volume should follow the price movements. Let's take a look at some other signals that you might find interesting. The moving average convergence divergence is indicating a sell signal. The pivots are showing a sell signal 9 days ago. Bollinger bands are suggesting a buy signal 34 days ago. The short-term moving average is indicating a buy signal 5 days ago. The long-term moving average is indicating a buy signal 54 days ago. The relation between the short and long moving averages is showing a buy signal 51 days ago. Now, let's shift our focus to the 12-month chart. The short moving average is indicating a sell signal 43 days ago. The long-term moving average is indicating a buy signal 30 days ago. The relation between the short and long moving averages is showing a buy signal 23 days ago. If you want to explore more signals, be sure to visit our page at stockinvest.us. Today we will be discussing support, risk, and stop loss for Marathon Patent. Marathon Patent has found support from accumulated volume at $24.78. This level may present a buying opportunity as we can expect an upwards reaction when the support is being tested. However, it's important to note that this stock may experience significant volatility throughout the day. The prediction interval from the Bollinger Band is quite large, indicating that it carries a very high risk classification. Looking at recent data, we observe that the stock moved $1.92 between its high and low points in the last trading session, which translates to a 7.76% price fluctuation. Over the past week, the stock has shown an average daily volatility of 13.74%. Before we start discussing potential trading levels for Marathon Patent, let's first go over some important fundamental data. Firstly, let's talk about the price-to-earnings ratio, or P-E ratio. This ratio is crucial as it measures a company's current share price in relation to its per-share earnings. A negative P-E ratio indicates that the company is experiencing negative earnings or is losing money. It's not uncommon for established companies to face challenging periods, often due to factors beyond their control. However, consistently negative P-E ratios may indicate insufficient profit and potential risks of bankruptcy. Now, let's move on to the next piece of information. The earnings report for Q4 2023 is expected to be released on March 21, 2024. Analysts' consensus estimates for this report stand at $0.0600. It's important to keep a close eye on these numbers as they can have a significant impact on stock prices. Today, let's explore some potential day trading levels for Marathon Patent. If the stock is on an upward trend, the first resistance level for Marathon Patent is at $25.98. If you don't own any shares, it might be wise to wait for this level to be breached before entering a position. However, if you're already holding the stock, this could be a level worth considering for swing trading. On the downside, Marathon Patent encounters its first support level at $24.78. If this support level holds, it could present a good entry point, with the potential for a rebound in the stock price. The combined average rating for Marathon Patent from multiple analyst sources is a buy. Now, let's dive into some recent insider trades. On December 15, 2020, Teal Frederick G. conducted an insider sell of 5,000 shares of common stock. On February 3, 2023, Mellinger Douglas K. conducted an insider sell of 10,000 shares of common stock. On December 8, 2023, Swami ASHU conducted an insider buy of 146,617 shares of common stock. On December 8, 2023, Swami ASHU conducted an insider sell of 12,430 shares of common stock. On December 8, 2023, 
Swami ASHU conducted an insider sell of 1,405 shares of common stock. Based on the 100 most recent insider trades, we've calculated the insider power to be positive with a ratio of 51.798. Overall, insiders purchased 2,673,855 shares and sold 915,564 shares in the last 100 trades. For this stock, we recommend setting the stop loss at $24.24, which is a decrease of 5.78%. It's important to note that this stock experiences significant daily movements, resulting in high risk. We have identified a sell signal from a pivot top that occurred 8 days ago. Is Marathon Patent Stock a good buy? Based on several short-term signals and a generally positive trend, it appears that Marathon Patent Stock may present a buying opportunity in the short term. However, our analysis indicates that the current price is overvalued, considering the volatility and movements from the last trading day. Looking ahead to Wednesday, January 10, we anticipate Marathon Patent to open down $0.0133 and begin trading at $25.72. Before we dive into today's topic, let's address an important reminder. Trading comes with a high risk of losing money, so it's crucial to consult a financial advisor before making any decisions regarding buying or selling securities. Remember, stockinvest.us should not be the sole basis for your investment choices. By using the information provided, you acknowledge and take responsibility for your own investment decisions. Welcome to Stock Invest. Today, we'll be discussing our current view of the stock. We'd love to hear your thoughts, so please comment below and let us know if you agree or disagree. Additionally, share your target for the stock. Don't forget to like and subscribe to stay updated with our latest content. We hope you have a successful trading day and a beautiful experience. Thank you for joining us.